Oh boy, today is show and tell at school. I have to bring my favorite toy. But which one? I love Mr. Bear, but I also love the bouncy ball and my blocks. I can't choose. No, I'll just bring everything. Just... One more box. Closed. Perfect fit. Oof. I feel a little heavy. But I look great. Good morning, Minnie. Whoa, your back bumper is almost touching the ground. Are you okay? I'm fine, Polly. Just heading to show and tell. I'm strong. You look overloaded, Minnie. Carrying too much weight changes how your car handles. It might be unsafe. Don't worry, Polly. I've got it under control. Bye! Jin, keep an eye on Minnie's GPS. She's carrying a very heavy load today. Copy that, Polly. I see her. She's moving much slower than usual. Whoa! Why is the road so wiggly today? Just a little bump. I can do this! near the hill. She's driving erratically. Let's go! Roger that, Jin! <sighs> oh no! This hill looks steeper than usual! Slow down! Slow down! <laughs> Brakes! They aren't stopping me fast enough! center of gravity is too high and shifted to the left. If she moves, she flips. I'm going in to stabilize her. <sighs> gotcha! Gotcha! You're safe now, Minnie. I was so scared. I just wanted to show my toys. It's okay, Minnie. You're safe. But we need to talk about why this happened. Every car has a maximum load. That means a limit to how much weight it can carry safely. When you put too much heavy stuff in the trunk, it pushes the back down and lifts your front wheels up. That's why you couldn't steer. And heavy cars take much longer to stop. That's why you couldn't brake for the pothole. I put too much in. I made myself dangerous! Clean this up. But Minnie, you can't put them all back in. To drive safely, you need to be light. Pick just one one toy for show and tell. I choose Mr. Bear. He's my favorite. The rest can go home.
Suspension looks great. Your car is level and balanced. Wow! I feel so light! I can turn my wheels easily! Look, Polly! No wobbling! Good job, Minnie! I'll follow you to school just to be sure. <laughs> You made it, Minnie! Just in time! This is Mr. Bear, and he's the only toy I brought, because safety comes first. Remember, kids, overloading your car makes it hard to steer and hard to stop. Always check that your tires aren't squashed and your trunk isn't overflowing. Pack light to travel right. Wow! Minnie has cool toys! Catch the ball, Roy! I think I'm too big for this ball. Safety first! Tip one. Before a trip, check your tires. If they look flat or squashed, you might be carrying too much weight. Tip two. Loose items in a car can fly around if you stop fast. Make sure everything is packed in a box or trunk. Tip three. Heavy vehicles need more room to stop. Leave extra space between you and the car in front. Tip four. If a friend tells you something looks unsafe, listen to them. They want to keep you safe. <gasps> I'm glad I didn't crash. Thanks for saving me, Polly. You made the right choice in the end, Minnie. That's what matters. <sighs> Welcome back. We kept your toys safe, Minnie. I wasn't playing with the doll. I was inspecting it. <laughs> it's OK, Helly. You can borrow Remember. it. Engineering helps us understand how cars work. Weight and balance are very important parts of engineering. Hold the car up. If you overload them, they can't do their job to keep the ride smooth. Squash tires get very hot and can pop. Always keep them properly inflated and not overloaded. Being safe is hard work. I'm sleepy. Sleep tight, Minnie. No heavy lifting in your dreams. Next time on Robocarpoli. Fire safety! Thanks for watching! Need some oil! I meant to do that! Huh. Safety test! Safety test! Traction is the grip that keeps you on the road. Momentum. A moving object wants to keep moving. Momentum means heavy things are harder to stop. Vocabulary, stability. Being balanced and not tipping over. Stability keeps you upright on your wheels. Bye-bye! Yeah!